Good morning, Watertown Mayor High School band students. Today, for our assignment explanation, I'm just going to go through everything, um, both on both sides of the screen, so looking at me and then looking at the screen as well, because there's some things I want to show you with respect to musictheory.net, just so you know exactly what you're doing. Um, so the first thing that you're going to notice is that at the very, very top of today's um, folder, there's just one last time the... Uh, the digital lesson sign up sheet posted. There are about 30 students who have still not signed up for lessons and there are a lot of time slots as you can see available for week B. Again, this is this alternating week B and week A schedule so I won't see everyone every single week but every other week instead. This is gonna be closing today by 3 p.m. So it's really important that people are signing up for these lessons. Otherwise, I'm just gonna sign you up for a lesson and hope that you're there and if you're not, then okay, this is part of your grade. Um, and then you can face the consequences or reap the benefits if you're already signed up and are making your lessons and stuff. So it's, I, I, in my opinion, it's way easier to make your lessons this way digitally, just because you don't have to physically leave your class and go somewhere. All you have to do is make sure that you've, um, you know, got the camera ready to go and that you've warmed up a couple minutes beforehand and it's, it's easy and it's in the comfort of your own home. Um, so yeah, um, just make sure that you do that and we'll be in smooth sailing. And then after that, there are gonna be a couple different links to um, specific uh, musictheory.net websites. So the first one is gonna be um, to the exercises tab with the key signature identification. So I'm gonna flip around the camera and show you this. So what you'll wanna do is um, basically the, um, you'll wanna get uh, at least 90% on both the key signature identification and the key signature key signature construction um, game. So there's two different ones, basically. Um, so this will be on uh, based on completion, so graded on completion. So basically, um, as long as you do it and you get that 90%, then that's good. Um, so it's kind of like a pass-fail situation. So I'll look at the, um, let's see here, the identification one first. So what you'll want to do right off the bat is over in the corner um, on the... Uh, this tab right here, um, it's gonna look like this right off the bat. So um, for clefs, I'm gonna, I'm a nerd and I was doing it in other clefs and stuff like that before. Um, so you wanna just select the clef that you've got. So for example, if you read trombone, euphonium, or tuba, um, then you'll click bass clef. If you read anything else, then you'll um, click treble clef. However, percussionist, I want you to go ahead and do the grand staff here because um, you all should have piano background um, and are used to reading both for like marimba and other mallet instruments and things. So you want to click grand staff for that percussionists. And then if you click out of the clefts thing, for key signatures, um, it's going to be two different ones. So for varsity band, if you're watching this, I want you to select the, the first basically um, six here plus um, C major. And then if you're in symphonic band, I want you just to select all of them. And um, let's see here. Yeah, that should be good. So um, once you've done that, um, basically what you'll want to do is uh, to get 90%, that's going to be just 18 out of 20 for all of this. And then uh, if you happen to, you know, not get it first try, what you can do is just click on these three dots right over here and just click reset score um, and then that red button and then you're back to square one. So you can just try again. Um, it shouldn't take too awful long. Um, I've had you guys do a lot of those um, uh, watch those videos about key signatures and stuff like that and show you different things. So yeah, and then looking at the key signature construction one, this one is kind of the same thing where um, clefs, you want to be in the right clef, so I'm just going to go to treble for right now. Click out of that. Key signatures again. Um, varsity band, do the these keys right here. So the first, um, I guess, actually no, it's 11. The first 11 keys, and then you'll want to do all... Um, all of them for symphonic band and then you'll be set there and you want to just get again to 18 out of 20 or 90 percent minimum for this so cool um and then after that there'll be some submission um things posted up on schoology for you to um paste these uh, scores in so essentially what you want to do is take a screen cap or a screenshot of each of these you can just take a photo on your phone too if you want just of i'm um, trying to have the whole screen in there so that i can see um, which one you did, I guess for me to know which one you did, I have to be able to see, um, like for example, this little bar thing and then, uh, this little kind of metered, um, button thing right here to know which one it was. And, um, yeah, so it'll be just a, an assignment submission that you post those in and then you should be set to go. Make sure that you do both of them as well. Um, so not, not just one, but, but both. So, 
Um, other than that, that's pretty much the, the main thing. It's kind of just like a, a quiz day. Um, and then next week we'll be starting up a new topic and um, focusing on a different piece specifically. So um, if there are any questions about that, are there any issues with um, Schoology and submission and stuff like that, feel free just to shoot me a message. and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can at any point today. So um, yeah, I'll have that submission open until actually 8 p.m. So there's a, it's up for a full 12 hours because um, I do teach lessons all throughout the day. And so I'm not always able to get back to students when as like at a at a moment's notice at the drop of a hat so i want to make sure that if students are kind of waiting around for a response if they're not sure how to figure something out that i can get back to them and um and so that you all have time to get um stuff figured out and stuff like that and are recommended for it so and also this um submission of this is your you know both participation and attendance for the day so just make sure that you get that in and um yeah and have a nice weekend everybody take care